Okay guys, today we are visiting other star systems, but we are going close to the stars. Okay, now first we have to go on our star, which name, of course, is got to be Vega. Because I love Vega. <coughs> okay, that's, that's a bit funny. Okay, we are going close off the star. This is Game of the Dyson Sphere, and... It's a very pretty game. <coughs> Going close to the star. And we will see a beauty of our star and our systems. Oh yes, it's getting close, I know. Now this is our star, close enough. And here is minerals that are in uh, our system, like... Uh, on uh, I named Olympus. I'm shooting Emerald Ejector to get his power, but that's okay. And this is beauty of our star. Next, I'm also going to close system because I got space warper. So there's Savannah, Icefield, Gazes, and Frozen Tunda. We're going on that planet to. What's the space warper? Mm -hmm. Okay, we are going to Tau Ceti system. I named it Tau Ceti. It's not the Tau Ceti system, but I named it. Now we're gonna go space warping. We are going our. We are going out of our system to go into the another system. I know it's beautiful to go into this space warp, and it's pretty fast, as you can see. Sail speed three astronomical units. <coughs> Sorry, we're going on. The okay, this is other system. We are in the in it right now, and uh, we're getting close to the gas giants. If you're close to the planet, space warp stops. As you can see now, it stopped. <coughs> As you can see, there's a silicon ore and the copper ore, and we are back here. As you can, I tell you, use their silicon copper uh, using island, using good minerals to uh, beat a Dyson sphere. And there's a copper. Okay, I'm going to the star to see a beauty again. But this is not just any star again. This. Uh, wait a second. Uh, we was on this star. Vega was G type star and. This is key type star, which is more and more. <coughs> <coughs> sorry, which is which, which can live more than our sun and like that, and it does not have got that much uh, uh, surface temperature as you can see. Temperature four thousand six hundred forty three kelvins, and luminosity luminosity is what uh, they light of the sun one. You know, sunlight with one luminosity of the our sun, and Tau set luminosities of uh, luminosities of zero point nine, which is <laughs> zero point one times smaller. And we, we'll, sorry, I I must use a space warp to get there because it's too big system. Okay, we are close now. <laughs> that fast because. The space warp uh, travels fast and fast, like f three astronomical units. And here we are, another star, which is close. No. X with a three light years away. I will show you. It's three light years away. I came from this system to this system with the three light years away. Next is. Uh, Oh, this is a red giant. You would like this. We are going to Gakrax. Which is key type star again. We are going on Frozen Tunda. And here we are. You also can see this is very beautiful. And we are going. With the space warps. But I forgot to, I forgot to tell you. This power, do you see it? 1.15 gigajoules. That is how much power you have. 
and space warp produces uh, that power to down 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 and if you if it's hit zero you will never go anywhere <coughs> uh, target distance over here is one light years away and now we are in that system very good but can i reach it because i got i don't have got that much power left okay i'm going to close closer one six light six astral color units away okay i am gonna be close to that star and here we are to the new star sorry planet and this is filled with the titanium and iron this is the ores that are here fire ice is rare also kimberly ores and rotational period is minus 971 seconds because this planet rev is reversed the rotation because uh, i have th i have this at achievement here it is where is it <laughs> i got too much achievements and where is it where is it uh, wait i had that uh, okay okay i once again okay here it is the sun rises in the west this is reverse rotation planet don't forget and this is find and land on a planet rotating on a reverse axis that is a <coughs> achievement and this is a fuel you can go to and reduces the that <coughs> sorry <coughs> gives you more power for that as you can see it's very good 600 megawatt sorry 600 megajoules and like that and i forgot there is a power that uh, you can do it like 10 minutes how much do you make in 10 minutes or like that 100 hours 10 hours and more and there is more systems about that a tau city was in gakras i mean now the lichen is major is the red giant and like more and more and on my home system, I already reached 467 megawatts. That's too much power. And in the entire star cluster, you know, entire star, cl star cluster, it's a whole entire stars. This is entire star cluster. And I make uh, <coughs> 506 megawatts. There's a Kimberlit, which is mineable. You can place this mining machines <coughs> and you can uh, place those to harvest it I will show you but to harvest it you need a power and the power reduces like uh, wind turbines uh, and uh, such as uh, more things uh, and such as wind turbines and tesla towers but tesla towers does not provide an energy it transports energy on on the <coughs> onto the other wind turbine but it uh, does not provide uh, energy and we need to get working and i will uh, tell you tell you no not tell you <coughs> I trust you no? show you show you sorry show you uh, how it works you must get iron it needs iron ingots and also gear but gear needs iron ingots and you you just need only iron but and copper to make uh, a wind turbine but I forgot to tell you there are metrics that you can research technologies and uh, such as upgrades Upgrade is good, like in Universe Exploration Level 4, I got to Level 3 because I don't have that matrix, it needs gravity matrix and I don't have it. Okay, Wind Turbine is now got to be ready, it needs copper. <laughs> I know, it's a little bit of funny, it, it needed iron for a second but it needs a uh, copper now. <coughs> Sorry, I'm a little bit sick. Alright, Kimberlit. But we can make a Kimberlit for diamond. We need Kimberlit ore to make 
diamond and the smelters and smelters need things and and like that and there are acclimators which can save energy and there are many other types of that like hydrogen fuel rod deuterium fuel rod and antimatter fuel rod which is which i don't have researched <laughs> but deuterium provides more energy than a hydrogen fuel rod <coughs> which is very good i got deuterium fuel rods as you can see sorry this is milestone and uh, wait wait i forgot to tell there is a production how you are mining on on entire star clusters star clusters so like on local planet you mine only kimberlit ore that uh, means 4.6 Kimberlit ores per uh, minute. Now it's uh, five Kimberlit ores per minute because of a uh, wind turbines, and you can you can save them in the storages, as you can see MK one and MK two, and you can save them here, like, and you can transport them with the roads, as you can tell, I already did it, and you know everything needs power right <coughs> and now power is full we can go close to the gecrax it's time for go next stop is the red giant biwakenes majoris and uh, i know why is it named claimed because i always forgot which one i have got claimed and which one i don't have got claimed and i also do claimed at the second i just almost threw the star but if you go through the star nothing would happen to the star and look at it how close is it is it we're going close enough and there's a star map and you can go and you can just k-type star approached approached means you are close and you're not landed and there are some of the stars that are black holes and like that as you can see there's a black hole named the Messier 87 I named the Messier 87 it's the third of the largest star stars not star black hole we've <coughs> we've explored and next is we work in ga gas giant no not gas giant red giant and there's a airy desert and the gas giant gas giant provides hydrogen and the deuterium and us giant provide only hydrogen and fire ice mm, pretty cool right fire ice <laughs> i know there's two gi red giants in the star cluster, the Wakens Majority and Antares, I named them. Their real name is HD Billion Thing. And I forgot, if you're close enough, you will see a your giant slide for four light years away. Because it has got uh, such a lumino. <laughs> I know why it has got 0 0.970 luminosity of our sun. It's big, I know. And it reaches our 4 light years away. Okay. Don't worry, I got plenty more space warps. You might be asking, why are you why did you stop in the middle of the space? For show you how how it looks like from the 4 light years away. How it lights, sorry. <coughs> From the gas giant now we are in the ice giant system sorry red giant i mean the another country and <laughs> i can't talk that good i can't okay okay but that's okay you might be asking why do you why you don't know english i know english more than my own language <laughs> pretty cool right <laughs> <coughs> sorry i've just do it and 
Did you see this gas giant over here with 0 0.06 astronomical units away? Then you might be asking, why is it so colorful? Because because the uh, Dyson Sphere program did that. Dyson Sphere, not program, Dyson Sphere creators did that. And what does Gas Giant do? It orbits very fast, it uh, rotates very fast. There's an orbital period, we don't need orbital period, and we need rotation period. Minus 170 seconds. You might be asking why? It's reverse rotation. Very good, right? <laughs> I know, I know, it's not very good. And there's Epis uh, Epsilon Pictures claimed. And I didn't build that, as you can see. Mining planned, no, not planned yet, everything. And it's pretty cool. Mm. Okay, I'm, so, I'm sorry, wait, I was thinking, wait, 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 where am I in? No, 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 I don't want to land again. I want to go back to that arid desert planet. And also, if you hold the shift, it will uh, add more power to your speed. And such as like that. And this is... Uh, this is... <coughs> very pretty cool, right? The red giant going down. And I forgot, I have got base there. As you can see on the minimap, here it is. And there's a copper and iron there. Oh, you can see because I know you can see. And there's also titanium and stone. <coughs> <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm a little bit sick today. <coughs> So, with iron and uh, copper, you can uh, build a surset, uh, sorry, surset board, we, which you can, there's a component, there's a component with, uh, sorry, it's a component to the electromagnetic uh, uh, matrix, <coughs> and it's blue, it's beautiful, and uh, you need you need circuit board and magnetic coil. Magnetic coil needs iron magnet and the copper ingots, and the magnet needs only an iron ore to create a magnet. There's two things you can make with magnet: super magnetic ring and <coughs> sorry, magnetic coils. You you will be asking how is this strange to make from iron ore to a magnet this is we have got technology for that to make iron ore into the magnet and we have got other things like space warper as you can see i warped there for a second now we got a, a fuel it's time to get close we are already close enough this is good we can see this gigantic red thing gigantic red giant now we are close as you can see it's so beautiful and type star beautiful is red as you can see red and even from don't seen in the star map it's more beautiful because there are solar flares and more now let's go get close enough closer closer this is close i would burn from here wow whoa now in the star map we are approached we are close and it looks like you're starting to land on the fire, a star. This is so cool. Okay, now we have to go on the another system. Four light years away, and we we are going on the ep 
Epsilon Pictures. We're going on Epsilon Pictures one. And as you can see, there is a ring around us. Ring. It looks like a ring, but it's not. It's just a ruined light. Now it is time to get to the Epsilon Pictures. Bye bye, Red Giant. See you later. It was good, right? I agree with you. It was good. It's already two light years away. Oh, three light years. Oh, now we are going to another system. I don't know. Will I be good uh, enough power to reach it? We're going on the closest one. We're going on the close one. Is this a gas giant? No way. We're close. We were closer, but we did not have enough energy. Beautiful gas giant. And we can see our plant we can land on. I'm gonna sacrifice some energy. Because I want to get closer. Faster. And faster. Okay, here we are. In the Epsilon Pictures. And you can see that Red Giant still lights over here. Pretty cool, right? And next we're going here. And next we're going to Neutron Star. I want to see how this system looks like. Oh, this is a type star system. It's very good. Volcanic ash. This is where to get sulfuric acid. And crystal desert. I don't know what the crystal desert looks like. But we'll find out how it looks like. And next, neutron star. A crab pulsar. I named it crab pulsar. Okay, now let's get get to work. We need to get more titanium. <coughs> more power. You might be asking, why does it have this energy icon? Because it doesn't have more power. If it doesn't have power, it changes color. As you can see, it's now a little bit of orange. It's already orange. And there are many types, four types of colors in the power. There are blue, which means you have got enough energy. A yellow, which is you don't have a little bit of energy. An orange, which you almost don't have energy. And red. Red means you don't have got any energy for that towers. So we need, we need to get more. And now where is the iron? Oh, I don't have power for that. I have to mine it. <laughs> Let me... This is Dyson Sphere. As you can edit a Dyson Sphere. While I'm mining, I will do this. Thank you. And you can pause in real time, as you can uh, see, I pause it, pause it, click on this bar and it will pause as an energy, energy, not energy, a, a time. And you can make a dozen shells to make a dozen sphere and get more energy. But first you have to plan that. To plan it, you must do these things, what I'm doing now. So not Dyson Swarm, Dyson Shell. And you can do this, the shells like this. If you have got more and like that, I'm sorry. Like this cube, you got this cube. You would press this and you can uh, do it and like, uh, it will do another for other forms of Dyson Sphere like this, like this and others. 
but it must be sealed area and you can change a Dyson's Dyson spheres <coughs> look look like how the Dyson sphere look like as you can see it l almost looks like a ball it looks like a something's pretty cool right and you can remove it and you can paint it paint everything here except all for a star and you can delete them if you failed it you will press the remove button and you will uh, remove everything now I'm gonna run it okay, we have got enough energy not energy iron to make uh, more wind turbines this is titanium as you see titanium ore and smelters wind smelters for smelt iron in iron not iron titanium ore into a titanium ingot you need titanium ingots for so many things like titanium alloy <coughs> Structure matrix, titanium crystals, and so much more. Sorry, in the copper, not iron. Where is the cop? There's a five veins of copper here. This is genius idea. Okay, here in this way, there is a copper, and we're gonna approach. To What type? Oh, this is G type star again. We can get to the other star systems. This is other two stars we have to go on it. A type star and then neutron star. We have to go. And I visited a black hole area uh, earlier than doing this video, so I'll do I will do that uh, in the second part of this video. There's a part from part two I have to make. I planned it. Where's the copper? Uh huh. Here it is. And there is a other system. Thyla. I know, weird name. Also, G type star system. We can get there for 49 seconds. There's a water world of planet. There's zero. Zero wire. Zero copper. Zero silicon. Zero titanium, zero stone, 34 veins of coal, and the ocean type water. And we can make crude oil. You need that for the energy matrix and other things. And the spinny, spinny form stalagmite crystal. I don't know what is that. And there's 206 veins of it. You might be asking, why is there not a numbers for that? Because before before making this this cluster, I, w I didn't know what the one bar was doing it, but it made infinite infinite veins, not infinite veins, infinite resources. Wait a second. Wait, 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 what we need? Now we need iron. I had iron somewhere. Here it is. And while we are mining, while we are mining, we are just gonna do more dust sphere. Sorry, I just drink my drink. Okay, there is another one. Dyson Swarm that makes you make a solar cell like Vega system I did this is all 6,247 48 <laughs> it's more or now solar cells 6,253 solar cells it's doing more because I'm shooting from the Olympus 
uh, I will show you, but I don't. It's too far away. It's ten light years away. And I got only that views on the six light years. It's, it's four light years more. This is funny. It mines from the air. And we almost have got a power to go another system. We'll go another system. Now we're going right here. Lava, ash, volcanic ash. We're going to volcanic ash system. And I must make some titanium ingots here. Oh, but why not? Little bit of time later. Okay. Now there is a 50. 50 of these guys. Titanium ore. And I, ca I can make a titanium ingots. But you can make it automated by using a smelters smelters can smelt things like uh, where is it like iron ores copper ores silicon ores titanium ores and coal and also titanium alloy oh here it is just make a little bit of titanium here And we need to power those up for these guys. And then they need even more power by wind turbines. And there's too much things that you can smelt. You can smelt silicon oil, but you need the stone for that. And we don't want the silicon oil. We need a titanium. Because uh, because there's a titanium here, we are mining a titanium and more. And uh, and you might be asking, how do we just uh, smelt it? We need iron, or uh, not iron, titanium ores, and we need sorters for pick them up and smelt it. But we have got a problem here. There's not too much power. Now we need more iron. There's a series A. I know this series A's name. It's it was Bellatrix. Pretty cool, right? Bellatrix name. I will delete it. I will show you. Bellatrix. Okay, as you can see, there are too many. Keep mining. There are too many types of star, from A type, to from M type stars, uh, to X type stars. Sorry. I drink my drink. <laughs> and we are gonna. We're gonna go soon there, but first we have to go close to the star to see even more beauty. There is more titanium. I need one more mining machine. Seven. That seven, seven number you seen uh, earlier that I placed. This uh, mining machine was how much uh, ores, not ores, veins. It was covering it. That uh, that sound was saying that. And we need uh, yes, yes, they're coming. It's coming. One, two, three, four. But how to power? You might be asking how to power up these wind turbines. For power up uh, these wind turbines, uh, 
We need power. Not power, we need wind. Like this. We're in the energy ratio. Oh, 70%. And it's not good. Good is if you go. If you go on this planet, it has got 150% of the wind and it powers everything nearby. Okay, now I'm going close to the star. Oh, this is. Yeah, right here. Okay, we're going to new system because you've seen G-type star many times in this in this uh, system. Claimed S. No. Goodbye, Epsilon Pictures uh, system. I'm going to the new system. It is uh, A-type star system. It's 11 light years away. We can see it. We are in the outer space here, and you can name the out you cannot name the outer space, but you can name the stars like star systems and like that. As you can see, we're going pretty close to the crab pulser. We have got one light years away. No, I might not make it to the system, but that's okay. I will make it with the speed, baby. Yes, we are not. We are in this system, but we don't have a power. I ran out of power. If I had little bit of more. Power. If I had more power, it would be better. But it's okay. I will. Ca I can just speed up time. No, not time. Speed up myself. And there's a. There's a other system like neutron stars, and like that, but. M type stars. Now let's uh, talk about the temperatures and like that. Like the most not. Uh, sorry, I have to just get more comfort. Comfort. Okay. Yeah. This is most coldest star in the world. Is M type star, which is red type star. It has got two temperature of 2133 kelvins. It's a very cold. But it's still hot for humans. And and another coldest is right here. Antares, another red giant. It has got 3024 kelvins. It's still hot. But if you if if star has got more and more temperature, it goes to the key type star, G type star, F type star, A type star, B type star, O type star. But you can go on X, X type, because X type stars are just like neutron stars, neutron stars, black holes, and white dwarfs. That are three of the uh, X type stars in the world. Now we got more power. Let's warp. That kind of, that feels pretty weird. You might be asking, why are you warping again? Because to get more faster there. If I don't get faster there, this video would be more and more longer. And I don't want to break my computer like that. 
Uh, it's not funny to break computer, but I know. I know. Pretty beautiful, right? It's a A type star means it's a white star. It's not like a white dwarf and like that. But it's beautiful. But more hotter than our sun. More hotter than our sun. Our sun is a five thousand uh five hundred uh, thing uh, uh, Kelvin. I don't know much how much Kelvin is there. And this star is on seven thousand eight hundred and fifty Kelvins. Now that's cool, right? Cool. But neutron star is the most hottest thing in uh, this star cluster. As you can see on the temperature on the largest thing, it's seventy seven thousand 77 million four hundred and sixty four thousand twenty kelvins that's too much and if you go to the black hole it's a zero zero degrees it doesn't have any of the temperature and the stars have like this star eight eighty thousand Eight thousand, twenty thousand, thirty-three thousand, and the more and more and more, and also fifty-two thousand. Uh, this is taking too long. To just regen. Where is the iron? I know the deterrent field lord is so strong. It's so strong. But there's there are the fuel types like a uh, hydrogen fuel rod and like that. The hydrogen fuel rod is the type of a uh, fuel type chemical a chemical uh, uh, power fuel type chemical. A deterrent is the nuclear energy. And the antimatter, and the antimatter is <laughs> mass energy type. Mass energy type, universe, and complete this. And the final research I have to do, ex except those. Those are sides. And upgrades are more like uh, plus one meters per second make a move speed. It moves. Our mecha faster, uh, not V, not V, T technologies. Okay, like blueprints. I don't know how to use blueprints. I tried that. Like energy shield suit makes uh, makes uh, a fuel to to regen faster. To make to regen this uh, bar faster. This fast we we are now gonna get close to this it would be bright i know you will say this cr this man is crazy because i'm gonna go to the bright star and now go 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 stop no bright too bright look look behind you Okay. Now we can turn it around. This is bright star, a white star. You love it. It looks like F type star here because I will show you how the real F T F type star looks like. This is how real F type star looks like, and this is how our star looks like. We are in now in that system now, and it's pretty close. Solar flares were good, and the closer system is Crab Pulser and Kalab Alcap. Alcap, let me look at it now. I'm I want to go to the neutron star, but we can't see the system because it's more than six light years away and. This uh, this upgrade we are making we make 
able to view the vein reserve reserves in planetary system within six light years and this is more than six light years but it shows the six light years this shows six light years because it's colo why is it uh, why is it so now it was six for a second i think Okay, no, no problem. Now we're gonna go to the neutral star and end this episode because you will like this. You will like the neutral star because it's purple, purple and pink. Look at how dark is it. It's that way. We're going space warp, crapulzer. Here I come. Bye bye. What is going on? I can't see it because it does not have that much luminosity. Luminosity. Okay, this is little bit of horizontal location, but you will like it. Okay. Now I can see it, but I don't know if we make it because it's way well, we are in the system. We will make there. We will make there. We will make there. It's coming. It's here. Please let me survive. Whew, here it is. A crab pulls her. This is a rare star. It's not visible with a telescope and it's it's not that bright as you can see on the luminosity is 0 0.7 luminosity of our sun and it's pretty pretty far away because it's hot. Wow. It it looks very pretty from from this view. As you know, in real life, the neutron stars are not purple and pink like this. They made it in this game purple and pink, and in the real life, they're blue, because the most hottest star in the in our universe in the world is always got to be a blue star and it's not a purple and pink yes I know I said too much for that and we've got Kimberly Tor here again again and I will refill it and I will go close to that crab pulser and you will like it okay now wait this is good 67 where is it where is there two of the rarest minerals here Op optical grating crystal and unpopular magnet it's very good where is it i want to mine it right now Yes, behind us. Behind us. Look at this beauty. Oh. It's purple, like a new, like a neutron star. It looks. It looks like purple. Wait, is this a cool down neutron star? I would not know this I think this I made one fan fun fact I don't know <laughs> and we're gonna do it wait 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 here it is the sunrise is coming I like sunrises 
Yo! It's very good. You know. Sorry. Okay. We're getting to build this and go close. But we can go close now. But we might be careful. I tried that before I had a YouTube channel and it was too too fast because my was too fast because it was so small. If it was not so so small, it would be more better. But that's okay. We are going to the neutron star. Sacrifice some energy. Look at it. We are close. This is a neutron star. What? How much size, size is that? 0 0.39. Now we are close to the neutron star. Damn, buddy. Nah. Neutron star, Tanwar. Okay, Victor. Oh, boy, genius. Find and orbit a neutron star. That's very good. We are at a neutron star, the most hottest substance in the universe. Very cool, right? It's for. It's so small. It's so small that it can't be seen from a telescope. And as you can. Do you see this? It's a light. From a neutron, this craziest neutron star. Very good. Now we can go to this new all idle stars and go back to Vega, or go to back to Vega. Go back to Vega. We need to go back to Vega to. To see a black hole. It looks like Centaurus. This is so pretty. We all know. Whoa. Oh, this is better. Or F11. If you press F11 two times, it would just evaporate everything but except of our neutron star as you can I'm sorry as you can see everything here it evaporates it if you press two times but if you press it again it would bring back everything this is better you know this is good uh, can I have some drink okay this is good this is menu as we all know ah, ah, okay now let's uh, go back to the crab pulser one and end the video this is the end of the video Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to see the mo more of this beauty, please like and subscribe and enjoy. And enjoy. Always enjoy it. If you like this, please like and subscribe.